I honestly don't know how to start this video. So, what's Gucci? What's poppin'? What's happening? What's happening, homies? So, I know I have been gone for like a long ass time, like four months to be exact, but I'm back with another curly hair tutorial. It's a little updated because I got a little bit more new products, like this recommended by my lovely roommate who's sitting over there. So this is like the curly hair routine that I do every time I get out of the shower. I like to shower in the mornings because, you know, that's just easier. I just wet my hair and go. I do wet my hair every day, especially in the morning. So my hair is wet. This is not a microfiber towel. I know I need to get one. It's really good for curly hair, but I honestly don't care. This is what my mom bought me. So let's get right into the video then. All right, y'all, I got cotton mouth right now, so bear with me. First, I'm going to apply Shea Moisture's Curl and Style Milk as like a foundation to my hair, like a base, kind of. Then I'm going to use Shea Moisture's Curl Enhancing Smoothie and kind of apply that all over to my ends, you know, like a concealer, gotta conceal those ends, mamas, yes. Probably sounds so ridiculous on these voiceovers, you guys. Just bear with me, bear with me, please. Then I'm going to use this coconut milk from OGX and I'm just going to apply this just on the ends because that's where you want to keep the most moisture at. Going to want to brush all of your hair out, I like to use like a bristle brush and then go in with a wide tooth comb to just evenly part out my hair and my curls to be individual. And I know I'm going to look a little bit ridiculous right now, but I do bend over and just start swirling my head around. It really does help dry out your hair and then it loosens your hair too, so it's all more movable throughout the day. Then I'm going to take my little microfiber gloves that my grandmother got me and just start scrunching my hair. It also dries the hair without damaging it and... Just scrunching your curls makes them give them a little bit more of a definition as well. Then I'm going to just take this Super Grow grease and just apply it all over my edges so they get a little bit of moisture as well. Take care of your little baby hairs guys, they're still growing. As I did in my previous video, I'm going to be blow drying my curls until they are dry. And as you notice, I am scrunching them at the same time like that's the key to like, really lose curls is to just scrunch them scrunch them scrunch them so they're all the same Boom, so there you saw it, my curly hair tutorial. Well, it's updated, of course, haha. <laughs> Honestly, I just play with it until I position it where I want to. Like, I usually part it like there, like I have kind of this itty bitty permanent part there. This should be your finished look. I know everybody doesn't have the same curls, but these products have helped my hair so much. Over, I've been using them for like a year. Sounds about right. I don't know how long I've been using it. And I have cut my hair in the past since the last video too. And I did dye it a like chocolatey brown color. And you could tell that they are a little lighter at the ends because it started washing out and giving me my old ombre-ish hair back. This looks good. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more, subscribe. And I will talk to you on the next one.